For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright, let's do this new type of problem which basically they tell you a force F is given and it produces a moment MO that is also given about the origin. If the force acts on this point P that sits at a certain coordinate where they only give you the X, uh, X a value which is 1 meter, find the Y and the C coordinates where P is applied. So we're given F, which is 6i minus 2j plus 1k. We're given the moment that F creates about O, which is 4 in the i plus 5 in the j minus 14 in the k. And we are trying to find P. And P sits at 1 in the i because we're given the 1 plus let's call it p y in the j plus p c in the k these are the values we're trying to find so it's very easy because we know that the moment that f creates about o is given by the cross product of this vector which is op op cross f but you know that o sits right at the origin so this is equal to p cross f So to calculate this, you draw your matrix, you get your i, your j, your k, here you get p, which is 1, p, y, and p in the c, the values we're trying to find, and then you get the force, uh, Cartesian vector form of the force, which is 6, minus 2, and 1. You redraw your first and second column, 1, p, y, 6, and minus 2. You do your positive diagonals. Positive diagonals come out to be P, uh, I times PY times 1 is PY, I, plus J times PC times 6 is 6, PC, the J. K times 1 times negative 2 is minus 2K. And now you do your negative diagonals. 6 times py times k, negative 6 times py times k is negative 6py the k. Negative, negative 2 times pc times i is positive uh, 2pc the i. And negative 1 times 1 times j is minus 1. So when you add this together, you get py plus 2pc in the i plus 6pc minus 1 in the j plus negative 6py minus 2 in the k. This is the moment that the force creates about O. But the moment that the force creates about O is given right here. So on this side of the equation we put 4 in the i plus 5 in the j minus 14 in the k. Which means that 4 is equal to this, 5 is equal to this and negative 14 is equal to this. Let me draw a line right here. So 4 is equal to py plus 2pc. <clears throat> this is going to help us later, you'll see. The second one is 5 is equal to 6pc minus 1. You can already solve for pc. pc is equal to then minus 1 goes up. Uh, plus 1, which is 6, divided by 6, pc comes out to be 1. And the last equation is negative 6, py, minus 2, <coughs> is equal to negative 14, which you can already solve for, for py. By adding 2 to this side, it's negative 12, divided by negative 6, you get that py is equal to positive 2. Now this one helps us right here to verify our answers. We are basically going to plug in py which is right here 2 plus 2 times pz which is 1 so 2 plus 2 times 1 is 4 so 4 is equal to 4 this is just a quick way to verify our answers whenever you have a chance to verify it's always good to verify so in conclusion p sits at 1 in the i which was given originally plus 2 in the j plus 1 in the k final answer for the coordinates of P. This is PC, this is PY. 
please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.